Okay, so the moment we've all been waiting for, or at least I have, the opening of the special delivery crates for this year's birthday event. And uh, this is my own account for those of you wondering. And um, I'm kind of excited. Um, not sure what I'm going to get here. I haven't opened up actually any of these, um, you know, crates yet. And uh, for those of you wondering, you know, how did I get all my coins? I did purchase two uh, big coin packs. The first one did not have a discount. Uh, second one, I think it was like 4 or 5% off. Uh, typically, I try to wait actually towards the end. Uh, you get, uh, you know, better deals that way. And um, I decided to spend on the birthday event because typically I find the prizes are better. So I'm hoping that uh, kind of happens here, but I guess we'll find out. And uh, yep, yeah, so, you know, how am I going to go about this? Actually, before I do that, you can see I haven't uh, opened any of these up yet. And if I close that... Oh, another thing I forgot to mention too, I have been buying uh, some of the 100 coin, uh, you know, deals as well. I think it was like $2 something Canadian for 100 coins. And, uh, you know, that was a 40% off. So I did get a couple of those. Um, so I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to open up a couple of the 100 first. And depending on, you know, what I get here, speaking of which, uh, let's take a look here at, you know, the prizes. So, you know, what prizes would I like? Uh, Atomizer, Nucleon, Quarker, uh, that would be great. You know, I really like the Ivory Ravana, but the thing is, I already have one that is maxed out. I kind of wish that we had, um, you know, some sort of feature where we could actually switch our regular robots to the limited edition for, I don't know, gold or something. It would be nice. Uh, the Overdrive unit, I think I'd really like that as well. I'm just looking across here. The Ravana Pilot, actually the Nightingale would be nice too. And I think that's kind of all that I'm looking for right now. And let's just take a look at this other one here. So we have the Nodens. Uh, some of you have asked me if I'm going to be getting that and leveling it up. I'm not sure yet actually. <laughs> um, I, I am actually really interested in the Cataclysm and the Cyclone. Um, let's just see what else we have here. Platinum would be good. So there really isn't that many items for the Titan one that I would like. Uh, Nodens, Cataclysm, Cyclone, Platinum, that's pretty much all I want. So the odds actually for me for this uh, crate is really bad. So I tend to favor the other one. Um, I've mentioned this actually to others as well. Uh, if you have saved up your Platinum and you have like say the Kid Titan, the Titan uh, crate might be worth opening for you guys. Uh, if you already have a couple of those items, maybe not so. So anyways, uh, let's go ahead. I'm going to open up a couple of these first. Uh, depending on, you know, the prizes I get. If I get, you know, the prizes I want early on, then I'll switch over to uh, the other ones. So let's go ahead. Let's see what we get. And we have gotten gold. I'm hoping, you know, one of those pilots would be really nice. So Ravana, Nightingale, I think those are kind of almost at the top of my list right now. Oh, we got a Ivory Scourge. Those weapons actually kind of look really cool on the uh, Ravana too. Let's just keep on going here. I guess until like 5,000 depending on what I get. <laughs> I hope I get a pilot though. Okay, we're getting some components for the Nucleon. You know, I tried that weapon out and I think it needs like a buff or something because I wasn't really too impressed, although I think it would probably work on a Fenrir maybe. So we're getting a lot of power cells. You know what? I kind of hope when I do the one for my baby account that I get a lot of power cells because I'm burning through power cells like crazy on that account. And I think it's just because of the robots, you know, I have. Okay, so we're still getting the uh, components here. Let's just see what else we get. Probably more power cells, right? I think I'm going to end up with some atomizers. So more power cells. Let's just keep on going. And I know some of you are going to say, why don't you just open the 10? I actually prefer doing it this way. Uh, sometimes I actually go back. I think the best way, oh, we got another Scourge, Ivory Scourge. 
So I have two of those. And I guess three on the Ravana would look kind of nice. Just keep on going here. Maybe what I should do is open up a Titan one and see what we get there. Just keep on going. Jeez, that's a lot of power cells. At least I won't have to buy power cells anymore. <laughs> Sometimes, you know, when I'm running low on power cells, I have to buy gold for that and then, you know, purchase it that way. Just keep on going. And uh, these are the prizes I have so far. So we have two Ivory Scourge and a lot of power cells. As you can see, some gold as well. Um, let's see, atomizer components. <laughs> I think I'm going to end up with like 200,000 power cells here at, the, at this rate. I think uh, maybe I should open up the Titan one and see what we get there. So far the drops have been kind of terrible actually to be honest. So let's just go back here. We're going to go to this one here. Open up one of these. See what we get. Oh we got a Kyrosea. Although the thing is I already have I think one of these. I have I'm trying to think two of them leveled up. So let's just go back here to this one. <laughs> that one was a disaster. Let's just keep on going here. Okay, so we got the Quarker. Uh, we got the uh, skin for my Al Jung there, which is kind of cool because I actually have that on my baby account. And that one's actually kind of nice. I really like that one too. Yeah, I think I'm building up towards an Atomize or something here. So it looks that way. Let's just keep on going. Uh, oh, we have one for the Nightingale. You know what? I'm kind of happy about that because the Nightingale bot just by itself, you know, the regular skin looks kind of ugly. <laughs> so I'm kind of glad I won that. Now at least my, my Nightingale is kind of dressed up. It doesn't look ugly anymore, if that means anything. Let's just keep on going. <laughs> uh, let's see, we're gonna go back here. We're gonna try another one of these, see what we get. Are we gonna get the noodles? Are we, are we, are we? No, we got platinum. But you know what, that platinum's not that bad. I think that, is that one of the bigger prizes for platinum? Just take a look here. 500 it is. So I'm, I'm kind of happy about that one. That's a good one. Because you know the Platinum you can use for pretty much any of the Titan stuff, so I'm happy about that. Just keep on going. Come on, at least give me the Ravana, like, pilot. Oh, we got an Atomizer, the um, the Ivory one. I almost said Ravana. <laughs> uh, I'm thinking of, I don't, I don't know where I'm going to run that on, but uh, at least we got a weapon there. Man, I'm hoping to get a pilot here. What's going on? Come on. <laughs> Just keep on going. How many atomizers am I going to end up with is a question. Uh, we're getting the Quarker too. The Quarker actually kind of uh, felt like it was pretty strong when I tested on the uh, BR account. So I guess that would be kind of good. Um, obviously I would have to level it up. I don't know, should I go for another Titan uh, crate here? What do you guys think? I think I should try my luck with one, one more. Because these, uh, those are kind of getting pretty terrible there. Uh, let's go ahead. Let's open up one more Titan. See what we get. Uh, whoa! I actually won a Nodens. Are you serious? Really? Let me just go back here. I was having such bad luck and then I got that. Did I seriously win a Nodens? <laughs> I won a Noodles, yes! Man, I was not expecting that. Well, that was definitely a good one. Okay, so let's keep on going here. You know what I should do is I should level it up and then like one day when my clan is rolling out <laughs> I use that, they're like, what the heck? Adrian has a noodles? I didn't know he had a noodles. 
Come on, at least give me the pilot, man. Who else, um, you know, when you were opening up, were hoping for the Ravana pilot or the, uh, the Ivory Ravana. Even the Nightingale pilot. <laughs> okay, so we have another atomizer here. Just go back. Let's keep on going. Come on, give me the pilot, please, please. <laughs> Either the Nightingale or the Ravana pilot would be really nice because otherwise then I have to wait um, you know, until it gets into the training center which might take a while. It looks like I got a Nucleon there. And yes, we actually got the Nightingale. I've been hoping to get this one to put on my Nightingale. So I'll be able to uh, level that one up. Now we need the Ravana one. And you know what, if I get the Ravana one I'd be so happy. Although I kind of want... Uh, the Titan weapons as well, but that would mean I would need to open um, a Titan uh, crate up and I don't think I want to do that right now. So let's keep on going here because I'm hoping I get the Ravana pilot. So I'm hoping I get that, please, please. <laughs> Maybe that's a trick. <laughs> you got a big. <laughs> let's just keep on going here. Nope. So we have six more left and uh, maybe towards the end of the event I might purchase a bigger pack of coins to try once more to see if I maybe get um, you know the items that I want although I've kind of spent already quite a bit on this event I tend to oh geez we have another one well that's good but I'm not going to be running two nightingales the Ravana pilot would be nice though come on <laughs> And, 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 ah. Uh, well, you know what, guys? That's pretty much what I want there. Am I happy? I'm definitely happy. I got a Noodles and I got the Nightingale Pilot. Uh, also the paint shop for the um, Nightingale, the Aojung, as you can see here. Okay, and a lot of power cells, but I'm happy about that, so. You know, here's the prizes. <laughs> I'm going to be scrolling. Oh, we got some Platinum. I forgot about that. Yeah, that was a really good win there, too. And let's just go back. And uh, so we have 3,000 now platinum. Gosh, I wonder how many power cells I have. I'm scared to look. <laughs> 118,000. But you know what? When you're in champion league, or at least uh, high levels of champion, you will burn through those power cells so quick. Yeah, it seems like a lot, but you'd be surprised. So um, I think what we're going to do here, I'll show you my hangar. Um, we still have the uh, MK2 level 1 Loki. My rhymes have not been leveled up. Uh, Nightingale. Oh, you know what? Let's change this to that. Yes. Oh, and this one here too. Don't forget this one. Sweet. Yeah, my hang is looking good. Too bad I don't have the, uh, the pilot for the Ravana, but here we go. And then we have the uh, leech with uh, the scourge. Actually, I wonder how the gold one, the ivory one, would look on here. I think that would look kind of nice as well. Uh, here's my Arthur. And, um, you know, I'm kind of debating whether I want to level up the uh, Nodens. I might. Um, <laughs> it's, a, it's a fun bot to play. But I'm also kind of tempted to save up because I think we're going to get another Titan, um, you know, this year. You know, one more. And I'm wondering if that's going to be kind of like Ao Ming status, uh, you know, where it does like a ton of damage, you know, if you have the right weapons, of course. Um, but I'm kind of wondering about that. And uh, yeah, so this is my lineup. I'm going to actually jump into a game now. And then um, I think that's going to be it for the video. So let's hop into that game uh, with this lineup, with the new paint job for my Nightingale and my Al Jung. And um, yep, yeah, let's uh, see how we do with this lineup. Okay, so we've dropped in on Canyon Map and I've started with my Leech Scourge. Is this a uh, hover here? I'm going to move over to this right side. Let's try to focus this hover down. Yeah, he's going to be in a lot of trouble and that should do it. And let's focus on this guy. Oh, Leo, Leo! <laughs> let's move over to this side. Oops, sorry dude. And, oh, we're going to watch out for this guy. Man, they made a big mistake. They did not go for their home beacon here. I'm trying to get into position where I can scourge this guy up. So 
So he's hitting me, but I should be able to take him out there. We now have three beacons. Wait a minute. Did they get our beacon? No, they didn't. Uh, although there is a guy flying there. Is he on our team? or No, he's he must be on their team. Let's just focus on that poor Lancelot, man. He got like triple teamed. And what is this guy up to here? We gotta stop him before he actually gets that beacon. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Look how fast my leech is going. Yes! <laughs> Although they got that beacon. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Ah! <laughs> Man, they're getting another beacon back. Guys, we're gonna be uh, four-capped here. What is this guy running? Is that Thunder or something? Man, he's getting lit up. Uh-oh. Man, I got like totally frozen up there. Maybe I can target uh, this guy. Actually, wait a minute. Do that. I need to, uh, I actually need to reload here. So I'm going to try to do that. Where is this nightingale? He's going to, oh. <laughs> I had a feeling he was going to do that. Okay, we're going to get him down to his last stand if we can here. And that's not going to help. Last stand triggered. He is probably going to be able to go into flight though. Yep. I think he's going to keep on suppressing me. Let's focus on this guy. He's going to phase shift here. Need to take this guy out. There we go. This one here. Target this up. Uh, oh, jeez. I can't take out that, that Nightingale, man. I'm pretty sure he has that pilot for it, too. Because he seems to be going into flight really, really soon. And where is he? Is he above me here or what? Because I don't... Oh, wait. That must be him. This guy here. Is he going to drop down? We might be able to kill him, actually. Let's do this. Jeez. I need I need to get these guys to shoot me while up uh, try to get try to use that before my last stand triggered. Obviously that did not work. Oh man, ouch, ouch, ouch. Okay, so it looks like we are getting the E beacon here, and that's gonna be huge. So really well played to that player. Uh, these guys are down to three players. Okay, I'm gonna use my Al Jung here because I figured, you know what? Um, this guy's probably gonna go into flight here soon again. So we're gonna hit him. Yeah, he knows. He's trying to, uh... <laughs> trying to get him. Come on! Jeez, this guy's, uh... Oh man, he's gonna suppress me now. Uh-oh, uh-oh. He kinda messed up. One more shot. Got him, finally! Man, and you know what? That guy probably, he's probably going to drop in here with an Ao Ming here soon. Why do I get that feeling it's, it's going to be an Ao Ming? <laughs> I think they're going to get that beacon back on that side. We're getting the center. It's now 5 versus 4. And let's see if we can stop this guy from getting this beacon. So we're going to do that. Let's target uh, this player here. Where is that? Oh, that player's on that side. I think he's going to push that other beacon there. And I don't want to push all the beacons here because otherwise, you know, the game's going to be over pretty soon. Um, I want an exciting game, so I'm going to set myself up for that. Is that... I'm going to go for this guy here. Let's go for this guy because I think that that other player from Clan China is going to go for the other beacon. So I'm going to put some pressure here on this. And... Let's just do that. I'm gonna try to get inside his bubble. I think I'm gonna be. What? What was that? Someone just. Oh, and I'll do. Down to his last stand. He went into phase ship. Oh. I need to go into a flight here. Quick. Oh. <laughs> and can I get this guy? He used QR on me. I think we're gonna get that. 
Okay, I'm going to drop in at D with my uh, Arthur here. Wait a minute. Is that that uh, player again? He's suppressing all of us. Is that guy? He's going to stay on that beacon, right? We need to... What is my teammate doing? Stay on that beacon. Yep, there we go. Whoever was at Falcon, that was really well played there. I'm going to focus on this guy trying to help out my teammate here before I go to the center to get that beacon. Um, let's just see. I'm going to move this way. It's now four versus three. And we have uh, that one player. He's got the uh, Arthur too. So I'm going to get this beacon here. And I want to engage this guy at close range because I'm pretty sure his Arthur is like maxed out or close to it so let's focus him down I'm not gonna go past this uh, barrier here because otherwise I'm gonna be flanked by that uh, kid on my left side so I'm gonna break through this guy's shield I mean it's four versus two here I might as well get some more damage in sometimes it's a matter of uh, you know doing that if you know you're gonna win and there's a very good chance based on the beacon, but this also requires experience. Um, then you try to basically milk it and try to get as much damage in as possible. So I'm trying to uh, do that here. And uh, yeah, this guy's on my left flank here. We should be able to take that guy out. And now I'm going to focus on this guy here to do that. And let's make my way over to this side. He's gonna land. Let's focus him down here. There we go. It's three versus three versus two. I'm not putting my shield up here because that way I can actually move a lot quicker. Let's uh, switch over to this side. Drop in with the nightingale. And it's hit this guy with all my rockets. And he dashed into this the you know circle there, but I would have gotten there as well. So you wouldn't have been able to change it. And uh, there we go. So we ended up at doing 3.9 million, 14 kills, three beacons. We were actually down a player. Let's take a look at the hangers here. Uh, this player from Champion League. This is what the player is running. Level 3 Yao Ming. And let's just take a look at uh, this play here from Clan China. And he's running a level 150 Arthur. And there's the hangar. So pretty much uh, all maxed out uh, for the most part. And uh, this player over here also from iOS. Okay. And before we end things, uh, let's take a look at the rewards on a points. And there you go. So I think that's pretty much it for this video. In the comment section below, let me know what your best prizes have been from this birthday event. And uh, that's pretty much it. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. And if you haven't yet subscribed, consider subscribing. Until the next video, I'll catch you guys later.